Well, we're out taking the boys for a walk. And it's uh, <clears throat> fairly windy, so I don't know how this will be. But uh, I see there's kids swimming down here, so we'll let the boys go swimming too. We've got, we're using the GoPro on uh, the hiking stick with the gimbal, which I think kind of works all right. All right, we're going to turn you off for a minute. Cody's getting it. Dakota, that way, over there, over there. He sees it. <laughs> Dakota! Dakota! He's got it! Caesar, I don't think we're going to go there today. Let's go over to the other side. Go get in the car. Go get in the car. Come on, get in the car. Hey, howdy. Hey, heel. Okay, free. They've put some really nice signs up here. This is so heavily used now. This is the place to get away and enjoy the woods, I guess. Go get a drink. Can you get down there? <laughs> he lays right down in it. He likes water. We are at the falls. This probably doesn't come out very good in the GoPro. Someday I'll figure out how to attach this to Dakota. He's not as rambunctious as Caesar. Caesar zits around like a bumblebee. Howdy. Hey, you guys, come this way, Dakota. I tell you they, they bite when it's necessary, but not most of the time. This used to be a really steep, slippery slope, and <laughs> they put these steps in it. In my opinion, it's kind of sad, but <laughs> it's a really Nice place to come, I guess. As I get older, I might appreciate this, I guess. But it's still a hundred steps. This 
is almost like work. <sighs> this is the view underneath <laughs> to keep people from falling off the edge. I heard they were gonna put a guardrail up here, but I don't know. Americans are a little crazy. Pretty cool place. I don't know many other places that are quite this neat. Oh my goodness, they've got the stairs going right up to the top. I'm not sure why they did this. This had to be a lot of work. <laughs> <laughs> He won't bother. He has absolutely no interest in other dogs. Same with her. <laughs> it's a good way to train them. <laughs> Is there a path all the way up? We used to have to climb over that log. Yeah, there's a little path that goes wraps around. Come on, old man. Let's go. Now this little gorge here is usually a pretty pretty big sluiceway of water. This is the view from the top. And uh, this sluiceway is usually a pretty big torrent of water. But it's, uh, no, don't go down there. But it's just so dry. I like my pole. My my selfie pole. I think we're overtaxing Dakota. He's drooling. He's drooling. No, no, Dakota. No. Come on. Come back. Come back. Now the bad part about this up here is there are bugs. <laughs> You can see it's nice, clean, clear water. It doesn't go through any farmlands or anything like that. It all comes off the top of this hill, which is all state forest land. And while once in a while they they uh, log it, <laughs> look at all the carns. These are carns, in case you didn't notice. I didn't know I didn't know that until a couple of years ago. A carn marks a path for a traveler to follow. Here we go. And these are jewel weed. Once you get these little tiny flowers, if you touch them, they explode once they're ripe like that. It's nice and cool here, but the humidity is obviously around 90%. Because I'm not hot, but the water is running off me like it's just running off me. <laughs> I don't usually sweat that much. I guess instead of going back down the way we came up, which I think would be a real challenge for poor Dakota, I guess we'll follow the trail that goes to the hang glider launch site. And then um, we'll take the road down, which is not much of a road, but it's more, it's more road than trail. Here's the, I think that's the Onondaga Trail. I don't want to take that. That goes right up to the launch site. That goes way up. Caesar wants to go that way. Caesar's got energy. We'll, uh, we'll follow this trail that was at the head, the top of the climb. No, Dakota, follow Caesar. Bugs keep flying in my mouth. I guess I should stop talking. All right, we'll follow this trail, and if it uh, gets interesting, I'll bring you back. So this is the trail. Continues. 
this is the road. This they drive this road up with a jeep to a hang glider site. I don't know if you can really um, conceive how rough this road is. It must have rained in the last week or so because there are a lot of mushrooms. Look at that one. That's a big. Is that a bolete? I think this is edible. See the bottom. The bottom isn't gills. It's pores, and I think that's an edible bowl eat. But I don't have my guide, so I'm not going to take it home to eat it. Although if I took it home, I suppose I could identify it and then eat it. <laughs> I've always said I wanted to take a sled on this because this is really steep. All right, turn you off for a minute.